Hey everyone, I wanted to take just a minute and show you how both you and your students can access the Science McGraw-Hill digital textbook when you are on a smartphone or a tablet. This process is going to ask you to sign into your Clever account on a mobile device and then link that account to the McGraw-Hill mobile app that you'll need to download. So let's go ahead and jump onto my iPhone and download the McGraw-Hill Connect app. So I here I have my iPhone, I opened up the App Store, and I just typed in McGraw-Hill Connect. And that first app up at the top is the one I needed to install on my iPhone. So I'll go ahead and do that. And once that is installed, you'll see the app icon that's up on the screen in the top left right now. We don't need to open that app yet. Opening it right now won't do anything for us. Instead, what I want to do, I want you to open up your phone's web browser, whether you use Chrome or Safari. And I want you to go to clever.com and log into Clever with your school username and password. So once you're logged into Clever, you should be able to scroll down and find the McGraw Hill Education little app icon. We're going to tap that app icon and it's going to open up the McGraw Hill resources in a new tab on your phone. So once you are here, you're going to see your programs. But what I really want to do is just slide towards the left. And then once you get to the left, in the right-hand corner of your screen, you'll see the section that says Mobile App. And I'm just going to go ahead and tap Launch App. And what that's going to do, that's going to actually sign you in to the mobile app and give you access to your textbooks. So this whole part with Clever that we just did, you'll need to do that or your kids will have to do that the first time they log in to make sure to help them log into that app. On subsequent logins, they shouldn't have to go in through Clever, sign in that way to log into the app. They should just be good to go unless they log out of that app. So now we'll go ahead and head over to the Biology 2017 Student Edition. Obviously, you'll see the Teacher's Edition. Your kiddos won't. Once your kiddos tap on the student edition, they'll see that there are two books available, the mobile ebook and the Glencoe Science book. For whatever reason, the ebook is not available, so we're going to go ahead and tap on Glencoe Science Biology. Once we open this book up, we can look at the top left corner of the screen, and I'm going to tap that little bulleted list, and that'll take me to the table of contents for the book. And you'll see that we can download any of the chapters here. So your kids may want to tap download all, and that'll download the whole book. If they're just working on one particular chapter at that time, though, they can go in and just download that chapter by tapping the cloud in the down. And you'll notice chapter 5 is in blue. That means that one has already been downloaded on my phone. So I'll go ahead and tap that arrow on chapter 5. And that brings up the different sections of the chapter. I'll tap introduction. And then that will just allow me to scroll through that chapter, through all the sections, just like I'm reading the book. Hopefully this has been helpful for you, and it will help you and your kiddos access the McGraw-Hill digital content. If you need help, feel free to contact me, J.P. Presvento, or Robin Green. Have a great day.